the first general purpose computing system. In English, please? Didn't you learn that in grade nine? <laughs> How could our parents have given birth to such different children? You know, siblings only share about 50% of their DNA. Which would explain why you're wearing a private school uniform at a public school. that might actually talk to you if you weren't wearing that ridiculous uniform. Well, it's a good thing I'm here for school and not for boys. That guy didn't even know enough to wear a helmet. Still, you could at least look like you go to Degrassi. You look at Sab's sister. I don't want to see you lose out on opportunities just because people think you're different. How can you dress like that? If mom and dad see you in those shoes, they'll kill you. And, and me. So they won't find out. Otherwise, I'll tell them about Anya. Not magnesium. And who's that guy? He's in my seat. I'm uh, some new kid, I guess. But why is he in my seat? Um, excuse me. Is, is this your first day? That's my seat. It is. Casey. Claire. Um, I think you're in the wrong place. This class is for gifted students. Okay. First off, I would like to introduce our newest student. Casey, you want to stand up? Now, he's just settling in, so, um, Claire, why don't you show him around after class, okay? Now, without further ado, Principal Shepard, to say a few words. It's the chef. There's no denying it, you're different. Um, what the chef means is, uh, you're a unique class with unique skills. That some might consider weird. Intellectual pursuits can enhance the educational experience. Hey, you want to enhance your educational